Sandoval. I work at National Instruments Corporate here in Austin, Texas. Uh, what we see here is a smart grid energy system. And uh, our nation right now is going green, so there, there are a lot of initiatives to conserve water, electricity, and gas. What you see here in, the, in this demonstration are smart meters. And smart meters give us real-time information about how we're using those resources. These are uh, three wireless smart meters uh, given to us by Neptune Technologies. These are water meters. Uh, these two meters here are running at around 900 megahertz. This meter right here is running at around 450 megahertz. In regard to this portion of this demonstration, we're simply allowing water to pass through the meters. To do so, we have four water valves which is controlled by a compact unit. Uh, we're using a NI481 relay module to control those valves. Below, we have a motor, and that motor is controlled also by a compact rail, and that is the same uh, relay module that we're using to control. Lastly, we, had a, we have a quadrature encoder that gives us the overall uh, water flow, um, and we're using a NI423 digital input module to read the information from the quadrature. That gives us the overall water flow and uh, it tells us the information in gallons per second and gallons per minute. Now we're also using a uh, touch panel to communicate with our compact trio. In this uh, interface, we can control our valves independently you know, and also control the plug. So, right now, water is flowing from the motor up to the four segments, uh, through, the, through the valves and also through the meters. Uh, it's then connected, flows upward again, and through the primary water line. Uh, our quadrature encoder is giving us the overall water flow, which is around approximately uh, 24 gallons per second, uh, per minute. So since we're here in the R pavilion, uh, these wire wireless meters are communicating uh, wirelessly. And we have a PXI chassis to uh, intercept those signals, demodulate the signals, decode the information, and then display the real-time information here on this PXI chassis. This is when I turn off the motor, and turn on the motor, and this is when I turn on, on, off the motor. And as you can see, the, uh, the nodes here uh, show a ramp of the amount of gallons that pass through uh, a meter. Uh, this display actually correlates to this meter and we have various displays that correlate to the different meters too. Um, further on, with, a, with our vector signal analyzers, we could do uh, more analysis on the power spectrum and the channel frequencies that the meters are using. In fact, our vector signal analyzers are the PXI 5600s. Uh, we're using two of them because we have two uh, around 900 megahertz and also around 450 megahertz. Uh, lastly, we could also simulate a meter using our 5610 board. Uh, we're, we're simulating a meter uh, and we're giving uh, various information like the meter ID, uh, the amount of gallons that pass through the meter and things like that.